Unlike the ferrous group, who deals with things that stick to a magnet, the metals group deals with things that do not stick with a magnet. Aluminum, copper, nickel, predominantly are what we trade in. The metals group is a smaller trading group than the ferrous group, so we have 10 traders that are covering uh, effectively the whole world. Our Hong Kong office is our only overseas office, but does make contact pretty much on six different continents. So I'd say we got the world pretty well covered. Our customers are looking for a means to save. By saving and consuming scrap as opposed to raw materials, they are helping their bottom line for their company. As simple as it sounds, our traders buy material from scrap yards, put it in a truck, take it to a consuming facility that's going to turn it into new semi-finished products. And the finished product that we are making is behind us and it's called RSI and that RSI goes to an aluminum mill that is making cans. We own the metal from the time it's scrapped through the time it becomes this finished product. So an aluminum can takes 45 days to get recycled, melted down, put into this product, and then rolled out into another piece of aluminum sheet. We specifically deal with commodities in cents per pound, unlike the Ferris Group who does business in gross ton and metric tons. So we deal with considerably less volume, but in terms of price per pound, considerably more per dollar. We move over one billion pounds of metal on an annual basis. As a group, we're very competitive with one another, but we want to see everyone in the group succeed. David Joseph has a reputation for having some of the best market information in the industry, and we pride ourselves on that. It's not easy, but we work very hard to, to do that. The green aspect of the company, you know, knowing that we're cleaning up the world a little bit, it, it feels good. It gives you, I guess, a little bit more of a sense of purpose, and that you know you're not just trading paper, or trying to make you know money, which is what we are doing. But at this very same time, you know, we very much are helping to clean up the clean up the earth a little bit.